Okay, now we're going to give you a quick overview of the Daily Operation Wizard. The Daily Operation Wizard is found in the Wizard icon. And the Daily Operation Wizard does not become available until you have performed the full setup wizard and you have green check marks on all of the all of the uh, wizard steps and so we're assuming that you've done that preseason once that's performed preseason all you need to do to ensure smooth operation the rest of the season anytime you want to say change hybrids or uh, set up any mapping functions um, or change fields uh, the easiest way to do that and make sure that it is that your uh, seed varieties are correctly set up and applied to map layers is just to go to the daily operation wizard it's just a few uh, screen punches to get through it's very simple and easy it makes sure that you um, have uh, placed your planter in the right position we're just going to enter here once again we've got our help menu gives us a step-by-step -step. so if I scroll down on on the first page here we're gonna make sure we put the planter into plant mode our bar raise is going to be limited and uh, for this case we've got our markers in auto it's gonna tell us our bins are low we're gonna hit next we'll verify we have an operator uh, present our crop type our grower, farm, and field are entered. Operation instance. Uh, operation instance. Go to the help menu here. It's uh, used for applications such as replanting of the same operation to the same field during a season. So if we maybe had some ponds and we wanted to come back and replant that field the software is going to think that we've already covered that area and it's going to shut off the hydraulic sections or if you have row clutches equipped it's it's probably going to think that you're trying to plant that twice which you are but if you create a second instance it will clear out the map but you can keep keep your same uh, grower farm and field names you don't have to clear your field out and create a new field so operation instance we're just going to leave that at plant one unless we have a, a it rained out and maybe have a, a, a pond or something like that okay we'll want to verify we have our work condition entered and of course we've got a, a corn work condition here and this is where we can enter the hybrids if we wanted to plant a different hybrid on the left half of the planter uh, then and then another on the right half we could do that here but for our demonstration here we're just running one hybrid in uh, both tanks on the planter so we'll hit next uh, at this time we can uh, fill our containers if we'd like or perhaps maybe we already have filled the container we can either add a partial amount or we can refill container to capacity we'll hit next if we have any prescriptions which we do not in this case we could select our prescriptions from the list if we had a uh, one prescription on the left and another on the right half of the planner we can turn on our vacuum controller and bulk fill controller and we're ready to go we can hit run and it takes us right to the run screen or we can hit main and it takes us back out to the uh, welcome screen on the wizard Thank <laughs> you.